Hi y'all, Tornado Twisty Flips, how you guys doing? I just got out of the program. They treated me really bad there. And they were really rude. The chaplains were really rude to me. And the program was really hard on me. And I'm going through a rough time. But I still have God in my life. And I'm going to take this journey and this positive message to you all. If you ever want to become something, you ever want to put your life into somebody's hands, put it in Jesus Christ. Because Jesus is an awesome guy. He'll be there for anybody. He blessed my girlfriend with a brand new TV today for her birthday that she won in a raffle at a church. You all, I'm still here with you. Don't ever give up on me. I'm doing good, doing awesome. And I just want to let you all know that we're going to be having videos pretty soon coming back. And we're planning new areas. And I got this new graveyard I want to go check out. I heard it's really freaking haunted. I mean, super, super, super haunted. That's going to be for our paranormal page. Just stay tuned. Kaylee, um, Kenny and Kayla's Scary Paranormal page. I mean, stay tuned to that one. And we're also going to have new vigs coming up on Tornado Twisty Flips, like going on hiking, going out in the wilderness, coming across abandoned buildings and stuff like that. I mean, stay tuned. Because you don't want to miss any of this, what I got coming up. I got God in my life now. I'm doing good. I'm preaching to other people to help them out. And one thing, my favorite Bible verse I'm going to give you guys tonight on my YouTube page. God forgave his only forgotten son, the gift of life. Remember that. Remember what he did for him. And everybody should know that I'm doing good. I'm getting better. I'm going through counseling for my mental problems. We're all not perfect out there in the world. None of us are. We all battled through a lot of stuff. Some battled through more stuff than others. And I've been having a rough time this past few days. I just want to let you guys know that I'm doing okay. I'm hanging in there. I'm not going to give up. And I'm still fighting this. And I'm going to church tomorrow on Sunday. I actually just got out of a service a little while ago. And I'm going to be going back to church again tomorrow at 11. It's an awesome church. Really good people. Really good pastor. He preaches the word unbelievable. And I'm going to hand this off to Kayla. She's my fiance, and here she is. Good. Hello, guys. I'm just still trying to set up. She's TV. programming her new TV that she just got for her birthday. That's the TV right there that she got, 43 inch. It was blessed to her by Jesus Christ. She won it at a church. Church was raffling two TVs off and a couple other things. And it's a smart TV, it's a fire stick TV. It's a Toshiba 43-inch Fire TV. Very confusing. Very, very confusing and all that. And everything else. Um, I'm going to hand over the camera to her. What do you want to say, baby? Thank you all. Please like, subscribe. Today was just amazing. And I say happy birthday. And if this is her birthday, by the way. Yeah. her birthday today it's her birthday today and everything else and god bless her in a way that no other she was shocked when they called her name very oh, shocked i mean she was terrified everybody looked at her like are you gonna go get it or what you know what i mean like yeah it's an awesome tv it's okay. gonna be cool Hold on. i had a 55 inch Samsung, but they have no whatever, and 
everything else. Um, sorry about that, guys. Um, we're trying to get food ordered <laughs> from a Chinese restaurant. But yeah, um, it's awesome. We're doing good. I'm hanging in there, like I said. I look like I'm really tired. I, the program wore me out. I nonstop worked my butt off for them, and never had a break. And we had to wake up at 6 a.m. every morning, and go to bed at 10. And we had to do that every day. For nonstop, and it was hard. It was very, very, very hard. Very, very stressing. I felt like I was in a prison, like a prisoner. They threatened to handcuff me up to the bed if I try to leave. And I got in a fight with the bishop, almost a big fist fight. I got kicked out of the program because of it, but I'm better off from being in that program. The way they teach God is not the right way. The right way is to be there for you, even if you want to leave still be there for them the bishop told me to go to hell he says i'm going to go to hell no matter what and that wasn't the right thing i'm not going to give you the name of the place because it's confidentiality but it was it was like a prison i was in a 30-day blackout i couldn't have my phone I couldn't talk to nobody on the outside. I couldn't see nobody on the outside. And it was stressful on me. I had to stay there for two years. And I couldn't be around my family. My mom has a lot of health issues. So do I. I have a heart condition. I just had another stroke. A minor stroke again. And my hands right here are completely numb. My fingertips are. It never came back. My eyesight is going. It means just pray for me all. And just please follow us. Just please like and subscribe. And hit the notifications for more content. Because it will help us out a lot. I'm trying to do this journey for God. And I want you guys to support us at this. This is our life right here. This is the only way we can get paid. Is if you follow us. I'm not doing it for the money because I have money. I have sort of money, but not very much. I'm not rich by any means. Um, I'm okay. I can make my bills every month, but we struggle a lot. We don't get to go to any fancy places like we should. And Mewtwo will help us out a little bit if you just subscribe to us. And, yeah, um, it's all I gotta say. I'm gonna see if Kayla wants to say any more, and here she is. Hello, guys. Sorry I had to cut it short earlier. His dad was calling. Um, um, there's nothing much I could really say right now, but thank you all. I hope you guys like what you see and keep seeing, but we love you all. We love you all from the bottom of our hearts. And like I said, anybody can be anything if they set their mind to it. You just got to have faith in the Lord. The Lord will bring you there. Kayla had faith in the Lord today. And she's with that beautiful TV right there. That TV is a 300 and something dollar TV. I just priced it. It means I just want to say good night. Have a wonderful day. God bless each and every one of you. And stay true. I love you guys.